speed uh, i did a lot of uh, sir basically before this meet i gave ini of the october so in that speed the uh, notes and videos really and currently also sir i am uh, preparing i am planning to prepare after this my vacation for iniss so i would uh, very much rely on speed uh, uh, ppts and uh, videos sir and of course the questions of uh, speed and the gt sir I bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members of Speed Medical Institute to Dr. Rachid Shah for scoring a topmost rank of rank number six in DM Medical Group in NEET SS session 2024. Congratulations to you, Doctor. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much. Great and wonderful to have you. And you have, in some of your busy schedule, you could <laughs> join us for your time. No, sir. It's completely my pleasure, sir. Yes. Great. Can you share your detailed background from where you started till date, what I have done? Sir, I did my MBBS from Baroda Medical College. Uh, then, sir, I did my MD in medicine from uh, BJ Medical College, Ahmedabad. Uh, and, sir, uh, in my first uh, NEET SS attempt, I got uh, rank 6, sir. Got back to back. <laughs> Very good. Excellent. Great Thank job. You, sir. And uh, can you tell us what superficiality you're interested in? Uh, sir, I'm going for cardiology. Okay. Cardiac. Yes, sir. Yeah. DM cardiology. Excellent. Superb branch it is. And very dynamic, and they are all counterparts to me. And uh, <laughs> <Of> course, <laughs> <yes>. <laughs> so very, very nice. Now, can you tell us what all you did to achieve this rank? What is the preparation strategy? Uh, so, sir, actually, for focus neat SS preparation, my primary uh, goal was to solve as many MCQs as possible. So, uh, my post graduation university exams after I got sir only like uh, less than a month. Because, sir, I, I took a vacation of 15 to 20 days. So I had almost one month uh, with me. Uh, so within that one month, I made sure that I do all the high yield things. So my primary source of my knowledge was, of course, what I read and what I saw during on what my patients taught me during my and my professors taught me during my MD days. Sir. And after the time which I got, I focused only mainly on MCQ uh, prep. Uh, solving sir and uh, as many grand tests uh, as possible sir okay so how many hours should have spent and uh, how many number of gts should have given and can you share something on that yes sir so sir after i came back from my vacation sir there was no looking back i already knew i had so less of a time left so uh, most of my day was spent in reading and solving mcq sir uh, at least sir 12 12 almost 12 hours a day sir so, I mean, on the 12 hours, you need to, I mean, what do you do? You read books uh, from Harrison or what you are reading or you watch uh, videos or GTs. Can you be a little specific on yes, that? Yes, sir. Y yes, sir. So, sir, I already knew some high yield topics. Uh, so, I had that list ready made, sir. I, I myself prepared and from other sources, I got to know the, and my from, from my friends, I got to know the high yield topics. So, I made sure that from that topics, I reviewed uh, at least the tables from Harrison, sir. Uh, that I reviewed from the textbook and uh, from the question banks, I solved the uh, questions from that topics and sir GTs I gave uh, around uh, eight, uh, so seven to eight GTs I gave, sir. Okay, very good. Now, what will be your advice for the future aspirants of DM Medical Group? Uh, definitely, sir. So it's like your uh, whatever you read and whatever you see and learn during your MD days would be your primary base. Uh, as far as the current examination trend, the pattern of questions have completely changed and it is not related to what they used to ask in the previous two years, sir. So I would like to advise my juniors to thoroughly uh, read standard textbooks and uh, uh, dedicate yourself during your MD days and that will be the final decider and not what you read in the last one month uh, for specifically for NEET SS. So you have to, so sir, all in all, you have to be a very good physician to get a good rank, sir. Okay. That's what I would like to conclude. Great. How many number of questions did you answer in this exam? Oh, sir, I left only one question and that was in part A, sir. Part okay. A was, sir, very difficult. Uh, I And I didn't get time to review also. I had to leave one question in okay. that. Okay. Time to thank and whom all you want to thank that they helped you and to achieve what you're today. Of course, sir, it would not be possible without starting from always, sir, uh, almighty with the, uh, without the grace of who I couldn't do so far. And all my teachers, I would like to thank starting from my junior KG of the school from to primary, secondary, 
in medical college my professors in, uh, in internal medicine uh, training my parents uh, my family and my all my dear friends uh, and all the faculties uh, of the Sp uh, speed uh, medical institute especially i would like to thank sir wholeheartedly okay so what was your experience with speed uh, sir with speed uh, i mainly did mcqs and uh, with speed uh, i did a lot of uh, sir basically before this meet i gave ini of the october so in that azim sir's uh, notes and videos really and currently also sir i am uh, preparing i am planning to prepare after this my vacation for ini ss so i would uh, very much rely on azim sir's uh, uh, ppts and uh, videos sir and of course the questions of uh, speed and the gt sir now your primary exam is an ess exam or neat ss exam uh, so sir i would li definitely like to give an attempt uh, in this ini ss exam as well sir <laughs> but no, you, are, uh, you are eyeing at ess or neat ss cardiology uh, so sir after uh, so sir ini ss was my primary goal from october ini in that sir i scored 19th rank so i would definitely give like to give one more uh, wholehearted attempt for ini ss and uh, meanwhile sir i have a very group i have a very good seat in uh, neat ss also so sir, i am very thankful and relieved due to that <laughs> <laughs> so your pressure is stress is relieved but yes, still, sir, the stress still, is relieved. still your uh, journey continues in this until your yes, may 24 yes sir yes sir so I mean, I think you were very close. Last year, you got 19th rank, right? 19th rank, yes, sir. So, last year, last October. Uh, last October, last I should say, yes. So, sir. where you missed it? Uh, sir, I think I I had read, sir, cardiology well. So, sir, I think I missed in general medicine part. Uh, but uh, hopefully, that must have been covered during my neat assess preparation, sir. I hope, I hope that. So, now <laughs> that has been covered, now I think we can definitely... Uh, you can do well and expect a good rank and good outcome. And we sincerely... Thank you, wish... sir. I, I'll sincerely try for it. Yes, sir. Because you are a kind of an ESS material. Yes. <laughs> yes, sir. You missed it for some reasons you said. Yes, sir. For Yes, sir. For one or two questions, I missed it. So now, I think we should make that attempt. The stress level is less. Now you can do happily. And now, uh, when you give that with kind of a balanced trust... Now your performance will be much better than the last one. And so that uh, you can do well in the upcoming exam. We wish you all the best and all the success. For you. Thank, thank you so much. Anyway, as you said, you're you already a cardiologist now. There is no doubt about it. As you're right. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> this is just... One yes, sir. I'm, I'm relieved due to that, sir. But uh, getting an INI seat would be a uh, brownie point, sir, for me. <laughs> yeah, because you have worked through Brown World 12th edition. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes. I've so, have done that. Yeah, I know that. <laughs> I could see it. So <laughs> I, I wish you all the very best and all the success to be a great cardiologist end of the day, wherever you do. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank all you. the best. All the best. Thank you.